All right, we're back. We're gonna try to get the uh, the last few levels of Ripto's Rage done and get the platinum. Um, hopefully, hopefully. I know that once we get to the third game, there's a whole bunch of hidden trophies, so I really need to might have to look that up once we get there. But that's gonna be uh, a ways off because we still got to do like every single level in the. Uh, in the last home world, the winter with the winter tundra. Um, all right, so let's see. Yeah, I need to go back to winter tundra. Where is the is it over here? Yeah, okay. First level we're going to do is uh, Mystic Marsh. Which I think that's the level with like the... It's in like the, the desert. Not in the desert, but like in the... Uh, like the plains or something like that. But I think I remember... A specific part of that level that I... That's not very fun. Um, or maybe that's the third game. Now that I think about it. Might be the third game that I'm thinking of. I don't remember what Mystic Marsh is like. I guess we'll see soon enough. Entering Mystic Marsh. See if this, uh, yeah, this is the level that I was thinking of. I think, yeah, it is. I was trying to remember if it was elephants or if it was like rhinos. And I have to charge every single one of the monkeys in this level for the trophy. So that's gonna be fun. Okay. Now, how do I charge the monkey? Let's see. I can just. Okay, I thought maybe I might need like a double jump or something. Not the double jump. Um, like uh, some type of power up or something to be able to actually get to him. Apparently not. Okay, so far so good. At least I can hit fodder, unlike in the gulp level, which was a lot more difficult than it sounded. I think there's a um, there's a key or something in one of these like buildings. I'm pretty sure like one of these buildings is actually open. And there's a key or something in it. Nice. So far so good on the monkeys though. So that's good. I guess we'll get everything underwater. Um, real quick. If we can, I don't think there's anything this way. Some of these gems are so hard to see underwater, like the red ones, that's so like really dark.
can't remember what I have to do with that duck. I think I have to like find all the eggs or something maybe and like throw them near him or something like that. Let's see. Let's go over here. Him out. Damn elephant, die. There's nothing up here. <clears throat> I think there's like a secret over here. So I have to like, yeah, I have to like do that. I think maybe it's the professor or something that's over here. Yeah, it is. What do you want, bud? Spyro, so glad you're here. I'm perfectly useless without my trusty pencil, and I seem to have lost it. I do have this extra egg. Perhaps you can trade it for my pencil. Perhaps. I, I don't remember. I think, oh, there's like a series of things you need to do, isn't there? I don't actually want that just yet. I just gotta remember that it's over there. Alright, this is the same duck as before. I wasn't sure if it was, but it looks like it is. Alright, I think the only thing I need to do now is, uh, is go up. charge all these damn monkeys when I see them. Is there a supercharge in this area? I can't remember. But the way that these platforms are looking, it makes me think that there's going to be one. Nice. That's gotta be close to all the uh, monkeys. A seed goes there, I think. I think I have to take the egg to somebody and he gives me like something else and then I take that somewhere and it gives me even another thing or something like that. Cross. I may have to glide across that way, maybe. Looks like the power ups are are up too. That's the end of the level. No, that's an orb, not the end of the level. Thought for some reason it might be the end of the level. Uh, oh, uh, I, must have well, I got the monkey tr uh, oh, yeah, trophy, like so I ain't gotta worry about that. Switch off. Here, take this orb and um, don't mention my little nap to Hydra, okay? Oh, these guys don't have talismans. Okay, that's right. The end of the level, they don't have talismans. They have orbs instead because uh, we don't need talismans in order to get to the last boss. Got it. Is there anything down here? No. Hmm. Interesting. Ah, there's where the egg needs to go. Okay.
I'm trying to clear out one area at a time, that way I don't like lose track of where I'm supposed to be going. You've stolen my spark plugs and I'm stuck here. Please get the four plugs back. There's four thieves I have to chase down? Are you serious? Ugh. It's gonna be a bit annoying. I'm pretty sure I cannot touch the red. Oh, okay. It's these types of thieves, I guess. I can't touch the purple, uh, fluorine or whatever, or water. Now, how do I get this? I guess like that. That works, I guess. Oh, they swim too? That's gonna be fun. Do I have to do it in order? Where'd he go? Oh, so now he's doing it reverse. Nice, got him. That's one. There's still another three that I need to get. Pretty sure I missed. No, I didn't miss a gym. I thought I did. That leads me back here. There was another area as well. <laughs> Over here. Take out all the enemies, just so I ain't gonna worry about them. Especially since I probably have to chase another one of those damn kangaroos around over here. Now, how did he get up there? It's gotta be the other way. Clearly, have to glide across here to there, but how do I get up there? That's the question. This way? Oh, you didn't even see me. That works. There's another one over here. Oh, that was. What are you. Oh, you really just gonna run around in a circle, dude? Seriously? Okay. Let's go and get some uh, health. For sparks and then there's one more where could he be I think he's maybe he's on top of here that makes sense to me now where exactly he'd be I don't know
Is the egg still where I put it? No, it must have respawned with the professor. That's fine. Mm, where is this last kangaroo at? There's the last gym. At least I think this is the last gym. Yeah, okay, that's the last gym. Now, where is this kangaroo? Or whatever he is. I think he's a kangaroo. Oh, there he is. Oh my gosh, he would be the fastest one too. Nice, got him. So that's a cool we got that now all we have to do is the professor's little side mission and then we're done with this level and he's over here my do I here's an do you need a new egg? So you, just got, you got plenty of eggs, but you lost your pencil. That, that just tells me that he needs to uh, carry around more than one pencil. Okay, so he that drops a seed, which we then have to take over here. Okay, the duck. I have no idea where this one goes. Is this is this for the the, uh, the cauldron? Maybe I don't know where else it would go. If it's not the cauldron. I'm gonna try the cauldron and see if that's that works. Wait, what? What is this? Some type of coin. Oh, the fountain. There's the pencil. Cool. again here take this orb for safekeeping it's the smallest pencil I've ever seen in my life it. no I'm just kidding I actually have probably seen smaller pencils than that all right um this should be a hundred percent nice exit now what is the next level um 
cloud temples. Do not kill any sheep in the cloud temples. Okay. I just can't kill any sheep. I think the cloud temples are this way. Yep. I thought this was a different level. I Avalar's most powerful magicians until that big warlock over there stole my wand. He and his friends have used the magic within to take over the city. Okay. Um, I don't remember this level that much. I honestly thought this was a completely different level than it is. Okay, cool. I can headbutt those things. I just had to remember, I cannot kill any sheep. to the sheep. I'm kind of hoping those rams don't count as sheep. Oh, that was an accident. I haven't seen any sheep yet. There's a sheep. over here more gems over here that guy wants me to do something special oh I remember this level more now that I saw that big guy off to the the left outside they have to escort him or something or no I have to like follow him without him like seeing me follow him City from the claws of those evil warlocks. Please take this orb. I foresee that it will help you on your journey. Okay. Well, okay, so now I can kill sheep.
Can't go down there. I'm a secret agent. I'm going to my secret hideout. Only members of my secret club are allowed to go there. I'm not leaving unless you hide behind that tree so you can't see me. <laughs> Does he actually tell you what to do? You have to hurry up or else the door shuts behind him. I'll just try to finish this and I'll get all the rest of the gems after I finish this. Secret club after all. Here, take this secret decoder. It will allow us to send secret messages. <laughs> I used to think that level was actually or that uh that little submission was hard back when I was a kid. Cause I think I think if you don't make it in time or something like the door shuts, so you have to be pretty fast. I think you might have had to even be faster in the original though. All right, so let's go back. Where did it drop? Oh, right there. Alright, there's one more side quest I need to do. Here. And that's for this guy. This super freeze power up will chill out the trolls, but we really need the bells to ring. They'll ring if you charge into them. Okie dokie. That's such a cool, like, like breath thing. Okay, I can't do it from that far away. That looks good. There's one. Do I have to glide? Oh no, he's moving. Can't be that high. I need him to be a little bit lower. There we go. That looks good. I suppose you want an orb for doing that. Well, I'm afraid not. There's still one bell left. You can get to it by using the whirlwind behind me. Fair enough. 
behind you. Oh, okay. Oh, that was... Oh my gosh, really? I thought I had that one. There we go. Nice. Thanks, Spyro. Whew. I didn't think you could do it. Here, have a souvenir from the Cloud Temple's gift shop. Thanks. I think I'm missing a few gems though. Where is the last of the gems? Oh, duh. How do I unlock this though? Hmm. Is there like a... Oh, got it. I found it. I have to run out and flame it, and then it should blow it up. I don't have enough. And then I should be the last of the gems in this level, I think. And then I only have like, what? Two more levels to go, I think. That wasn't it. I'm missing a few more. It's that way. Oh, well, I just fell and died. That works, I guess. That's one, one way to get me back down there. Or back uh, to where I might need to be. No, that actually made it even further away. Where's it at, Sparks? Below us. Is it literally this one gym? Oh my gosh. I missed one gym. Thank God for sparks in this game. <laughs> Alright, well, I'll be back. I'm going to go ahead and use the restroom real quick. Alright, we back, boys. Let's try to uh, 
do these last two levels. I think there's only two more levels. Maybe there's three. Uh, which one's the next one that I need to do? I think it's Robotic Farms. No, it's Metropolis. Alright. <clears throat> I think Metropolis is down this way. Yep. What do I need to do? Defeat the ox without taking a hit. I need to beat a bomb throwing ox. Okay. This insurrection from the farms has got quite out of hand. We need someone to restore order. Find the inventor droid. She's been working on something big. Okay. So this is another like Zephyr and Breeze Harbor thing where like the farms are like in invading the uh Metropolis and Metropolis is like invading the farms or something. With all the budget cuts. These elevators need serious work. See, this one here is stuck. I expect it will start working again if you just give it a good whack, though. Oh, I have to headbutt it, maybe. Yep. That works. Oh wait, that killed them both because I knocked it into him. Oh wow, huh? That's something. Nice. I'm like I'm concentrating a little bit because these are, these are some of the harder uh, levels in the game. They're still not that hard, but they are harder than uh, most of the other ones. Oh, there's a ladder up there. I just saw it. I wonder if there are any more ladders that I missed. Now, here's the ox. A vicious ox has taken over our armory. And here we thought that freezing the walkway would keep animals out. The ox is very tough. I would advise using the bombs against it. And it will probably take several bombs at that. Okay, so I have to beat this guy without getting hit. Okay, that's one. Oh wow. Okay, so how do I how do I restart the challenge? We will never regain Does this restart the challenge? No, it doesn't. There's there's I know there's a way to restart the challenge, I'm trying to find it out. Um, exit the challenge and then try again. Let's see if this does this restart it. We will no.
Maybe I'll just uh, die to it or something. I wonder how else I can do this. Can I like, is there a way to fall off the edge of the world or something? Yeah, that'll work. Oh, I can't fall off the edge of the world. I'll just die right here then. All right, that works. Hopefully since I did that, it will reset the, uh, the challenge. Maybe. Hopefully. Yeah, that's like uh, questionable at best. This is not easy. Because if the bombs even touch you, you get hit. So you have to, uh, I don't know how the hell I'm supposed to aim it at him. It's not that hard. It's just like, the boss isn't hard. It's just that going without getting hit is going to be um, a lot more difficult than it sounds. Like, it won't even go back back to him straight though like I'm not even fucking in the arena okay whatever I'm starting to get frustrated because when I hit it back at him it doesn't go straight it goes off to like some angle and I'm trying to think about how how I'm gonna hit him if everything goes at an angle I have to get lucky and I hate that about bosses. If, if there's a boss you have to get lucky on, well, it's a mini boss, I guess, but I don't like luck. Maybe there is like a way to like do it completely straight. Maybe you have to walk, like, walk forward like that or something. Oh, there's one, I guess. Like, what the fuck, man? They would do it on the fucking ice, too. Ugh. This is gonna be annoying. What a trophy! No, it actually should. It shouldn't. It's actually not that bad of a trophy. It's. At least it's understandable. And it's not like a, uh. A grind or something stupid like that. All the trophies in this game are actually like, uh simple and doable in one shot instead of having to replay the game like 40 times to do it like i don't fucking know man some of the stuff just doesn't look like it should hit me and I wish I knew an easier way to restart the challenge than just killing myself because I don't want to run out of lives. But I probably will in this. How many do I have left? Like, like 15? <laughs> 13. I don't even have 15. That's just great. Oh, this is going to suck. Like, what the actual fuck, man? You really can't- you can't even, like, aim it! The angle's trash. Like, even if it's going straight at you and you hit it, it doesn't go straight. It goes off to an angle. Why? Why does it go off to an angle? It doesn't make any fucking sense. I'm starting to get really frustrated now because I don't- I really don't want to lose all my lives on something so... Dumb.
Like that's gonna hit me. Why did it? Why did it bounce off? Bounce again and then come back to me? That doesn't make any fucking sense. None. Like it literally makes no sense. It's pissing me off. I thought this shit was gonna be like at least like reasonable, but this is stupid. There's not really a strategy to it since they just whenever you hit it back at him it just goes off to some random ass angle that you can't fucking predict. Like that doesn't hit him. Like that should have hit him twice. Like, why did that blow up all of a sudden? It doesn't make any sense either. Like, what the fuck, man? That should not have fucking hit me. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh my god, fuck this. Fuck this fucking level. This fucking ox is retarded. This is stupid. Like, it goes off to an angle. Why does it do that? Alright. This fucking thing sucks. The worst fucking thing in the entire game this is this dumbass ox that doesn't make any fucking sense. With nine lives left, can he do it? Probably not. I don't have any confidence in this in this at all because it's it's fucking um, luck based. It's not like precision based or skill based. It's luck based. There we go. Please tell me I got the achievement. Okay, cool. There's a trophy. Good. Thank God. That was annoying. That's probably the hardest the hardest trophy in the game. Now how am I supposed to get that? I have no idea. I like how you headbutt it to go up. I mean, I don't know. I don't mean the harp on it, but like, I love Spyro to death, but that ox and that trophy for not getting hit is a little, uh. a little much. You kind of. I don't know like what I did and I'm trying to figure out what I did differently to like actually strategize for it is like 
You kind of you have to hit the bomb as soon as it comes out, and it seems a little bit easier if you do it like that. If you wait around for like three three or four bombs to get released, then the likelihood of you getting hit it goes up by like a ton. you were coming. Thank you for your efforts in thwarting this attempted coup. Please take this item, which living creatures seem to like. It's a first for Avalar, a combination power up. Thank goodness you're here to test it out. These invading sheep in their spaceships must be stopped. Okay. So she wants me to flame all the, the flying saucers. Fair enough. I think there's two levels to this. To this, uh... Flying section. There's the last saucer, let's see. Excellent work. You knock those sheep right. Maybe not. Maybe that's it, and then you have to like uh I knew it. Those first sheep sent out a distress call. The next wave of saucers. Yep, is there's more, coming. okay. I thought so. I can't remember if these ones shoot back at you. Yeah, they do. There's two more. Where's the last one? There it is. Nice. nice flying airmen. You've proven the genius of my double power up invention. Here, keep this to commemorate your victory. She's giving me three orbs in total. Alright, so I need to um, get the rest of these gems and then I should be good. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Luckily, Sparks can tell me where the rest are. I need to get back over to her. there okay and I know where the last ones are I gotta go back to that old chest I need the power up again. Because it's down here. I'm 
I'm pretty sure. It's this one, right? And this should be the last of them. Yep. That should be 100%. Nice. Alright, one more uh, real level, and then the last boss fight, and then a speedway. So, okay, the last on Robo Farms, I need to kill every single one of the robot bees by fl by um spitting them, spitting at them. That's the trophy here. That shouldn't be too bad. Hopefully. So I think this is a B. So we'll kill that. I don't think that that doesn't count as a B, hopefully, because it doesn't look like a B to me. I need another thing to, uh, to be able to spit at this bee right here. I think I might have to go back to the beginning to get it though. Yeah. There's another one. Fortunately for me, there seems to be a spitting thing right here. Alright, cool. It looked like there was a drop off over here. I wonder what, where does this go? Oh, just a little area. Can I do anything with these, like, carrots? Maybe I can, like, headbutt them or something or does something, but I'm not sure. Alright, there's another one. 
So far, so good. Oops. Of course. Let me see if I can actually do something here. Nope, okay. Kill that sheep, get sparks back. Go ahead and grab one of these, just in case we run into another bee. Couldn't even hit him. There we go. It's another one of those uh, chests that I really can't do anything with just yet. I really need to find a sheep. Like right now. Did this sheep respawn? Yeah, it did. Wait, did I not get sparks back? How quickly does this thing respawn? As soon as I look away. It's like as soon as I get up here, maybe? And then it respawns? Yeah, okay, good. Because I need the health. Cool. Alright, we're full health now. So we should be good. Go ahead and take one of these with us. I don't know how many bees are left, but I'm trying to like take care of all the bees so I don't have to worry about the trophy anymore and I can just focus on the rest of the game or of the level. This doodad. All right, cool. You're welcome, buddy. Uh, now uh, I need to. There's one more bee over here I know of. Two more, actually. I see them. Nice. That's one. I think this is the last one. At least it looks like it might be. Damn, I missed him. Nice. Okay, that was the last B. So that trophy is done. I think I have to headbutt this to make it go up. Or maybe not. Oh, supercharge. It's a supercharge thing. Okay. I need to knock this up and then time it. This is the end of the level. 
And then there's a supercharged thing I have to do, I guess. Which I bet that's gonna be fun. Way to go, Spyro! Them varmints won't be coming near our crops now. Can I offer you a reward? Yes, please. How much is that? 62? I guess I might as well. Well, tractor all around the farm, but some fool robot blocked the path up. Do you think you can clear things up with a bit of supercharge? Maybe. All right, I guess I'll do this real quick. I was gonna do that. Well, I guess not. Never mind. I was gonna get this thing, and then, but then I wanted to do the supercharge, and now since I got knocked off the supercharge, I'll go back to doing this. I guess. I have no idea where that is. Oh, it's behind is it behind the rocket? No. It must be backwards. Maybe. Maybe it's this way? Yep, there it is. Um, back to this one. Nice. All right, now I have to do the supercharge, and that should be it. I think. Well, messed that up. This is going to be a challenge. I got about halfway done with the course, I think. It's not that bad. There we go. Piece of steer in that was dragon. Here, take this thing of a jig I found in the cow pen. Take this thing of a jig. All right, so that should be uh, that's all the orbs, but I'm missing gems, and I think they're right here. It's not all of them, apparently. There's more than that. How many more do I need? 50. Or close to it. Oh, it's this thing. Oh, I gotta get supercharged to do that. Okay. Yeah, like go around this corner and then jump off into that. Oh, 
Nice. Now where's the rest, Sparks? There's a few more. There we go. I think that's 100%. Nice. Okay. Um, So for the next one I have to do is a uh, speedway mission and I have to get, I have to defeat five of the buggies while charging. That shouldn't be too hard. I don't think that will be hard. No, I can't even remember where the speedway mission is to be honest in this level I think it's over here I think it's like over here yep there it is I'm gonna look up where the Canyon Speedway Orb is too, because I can't remember where it is. Oops. Already messed that up, so I might as well restart it. I messed that up so bad right there. I didn't jump because I didn't think I needed the jump, but I needed to. I did need the jump. Dang it. Oh well, it doesn't seem that bad so far. That should do the trophy. Yep. And then all the buzzards should be right here. Alright, cool. And then I have to do the hunter challenge, which it looked like it was right there. But I think I have to quit out first in order to do it. With the unlimited time or whatever. Wait, what? You can press R2 to flame as well? Is 
Is that a real thing? Hold on, I, I gotta see this. Can I press R2 to flame? What? I don't know why you would ever do that, but that's... It's something, I guess. <laughs> I didn't even know you could do that, that's crazy. So you can press circle to flame, which is what I do. And I think most Spyro players do. Or you can press R2 to flame. That's, I think that's an added feature. I don't think, I think R2 and L2 used to be like the camera in the old game. All right, so what I want to do is go to where the buzzards are, which I think is this way, although I could be wrong. Okay, and then there should be Hunter should be over here. All right, Spyro, are you ready to try out my plane? I just fixed it, and I'm pretty sure it won't crash now. Okay, sure. Spyro, here's what you gotta do. I've got the plane on remote control, so all you have to do is hit the targets with your machine gun. Press the attack button to fire the gun, and use your left stick to aim. Okay. more difficult than it sounds it's a little awkward this is so awkward but it's not that bad I guess because you had such a good pilot yeah I'm sure that's why it was I think that's the last orb I need I think that's all the orbs in the entire game pretty sure yeah so all I need to do now is oops I didn't mean to press retry is I need to def uh, beat Ripto I need to beat Ripto using all three of the of the power ups, and I guess collect some gems because I think there's like ten thousand gems in the game, and I only have five, six thousand somehow. I don't know where the rest are, to be honest. Unless you get like a whole bunch of gems for for beating Ripto, because I I've a hundred percent at everything, so. Maybe you get all the gems back you took from money bag. Yeah, I think that's how it is. I think money bags has to give all those gems back to you or something like that, if I remember correctly. So let's go fight Ripto and try to use all the power ups. Now that you've got the orbs, Ripto's demise is only mo Here's Ripto. Let's go. 
one of the best villains in the in the entire video game world. I don't know, he's pretty cool. Here we go. Spyro, we want to help you fight Ripto. Elora is using the orbs you collected to store power-up energy. Hunter will throw the powered-up orbs to you as they become ready. Even as we speak, the professor is experimenting with new forms of power-up energy. So you'll soon have abilities that no one has ever seen before. Okay. I think there's only three, though. I like how he calls him Shorty, yet he's taller than him. Apparently, Ripto is bigger than I am. Somehow. Oh, yeah, he can use the freaking orbs, too. I forgot about that. Damn it. So I need to use the blue one and the red one still. This is the red one. Alright, I need one more blue one. There we go. Alright, cool. Got that, now he goes into like Super Saiyan mode and uses like a UFO or something to fight us, if I remember correctly. Oh wait, what is this? I forgot about this. All right, cool. Is this is this where he turns into the UFO guy or whatever? Or yeah, the flying bird or whatever. That works. All right, this is the hardest part. And I can't remember if you have to do redo the whole thing if you lose. Where the hell did he go? Ripto, stop cheating. You're like two hits away from dying, dude. There you go. It didn't even show him slowly going into the thing like it did in the other game. Beat him on the first try, that's crazy. I don't think we could ever thank you enough, Spyro. I suppose you have to go now? Yeah, I'd better. They'll be missing me in the Dragon Worlds, and I've still got a vacation to take. I need it more than ever now. Before you go, I think that Moneybags has something he wants to give you. Hmm. I most certainly do not. Hunter? Huh? 
<laughs> Spyro, Moneybags is very sorry that he made you pay so much on your way through Avalar. We want you to keep the gems as a reward for helping us. Wow, thanks. Uh, Sparks, can you grab them? Let me just type in the new coordinates and there. Spyro, you can now go to Dragon Shores. Hey, why don't you guys come with me? I bet you could use a holiday. I'm afraid we can't, Spyro. Ripto may be gone, but he caused a lot of damage during his short stay. We'll be cleaning up for weeks. Just remember, though, that you can always get back to Avalar from Dragon Shores if you want to visit. Well, okay. Come on, Sparks. We got a lot of vacation to catch up on. Yeah. Alright, so we've beaten the game and now um, we've unlocked Dragon Shores and I have to go and try to get the uh, permanent uh, fire breath or whatever. So I can get the last trophy in the game and then the plat. I have all okay, I have all ten thousand gems. Step right into Dragon Shores Park. By the way, if you win ten tokens, you can visit our theater. All right, so we're not going to do anything in Dragon Shores really, but I'm pretty sure. Dragon Shores Coaster here at the show. You know. These are all, are these all Norks? Nice. So we've unlocked the fire, the permanent fire up. So that should be the last trophy in the game that we need. Nice. The platinum trophy is ours. We've beaten Ripto Rage. Cool. So Ripto's Rage is at 100%. Next we'll do uh, Year of the Dragon, but we're, I'll do that tomorrow. Um, for now, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And uh, I'll see y'all later.